Thank you, Christy. A local woman is representing Charm City in a national competition. She beat out thousands of other entrepreneurs for a chance to be featured on the new reality series, Queen Boss. Tracy Leong spoke to her about this once in a lifetime opportunity. The brittle queen of Baltimore is hoping to grow her candy empire and she's getting a little help from a TV show. Queen Boss Academy, 18 entrepreneurs, one crown. Among the rising stars, Natasha Wainwright of Baltimore. And my product was well received and uh, I know I did us proud. Fulfilling a lifelong dream, the owner and founder of Natasha's Just Brittle wants to expand her sweet, savory business to become a household name. Letting them know that it was all natural and I really don't have to say much once I sampled it. That was, it was all over. The new reality show on Center TV will be showcasing 18 African American female entrepreneurs, all competing for the Queen Boss title and chance to launch their business to new heights. Even some of the business women that were critiquing us, just getting some feedback from them um, and just just hoping that one day you'll get to that level. An experience Natasha is truly grateful for. What advice would you give to other entrepreneurs? Okay, first of all, I would say it's not easy. So first you want to make sure it's your passion. And if it's your passion, just get ready to go all in with it. While Natasha is already the brittle queen of Charm City, you'll have to wait and see if she also wins the show's crowning title. If you're craving these delicious treats, you can find them inside Buy Right at her store, or you can go to her website. That's natashasjustbrittle.com. Reporting in Baltimore, Trace Leong, WJZ Eyewitness News, and I can tell you they taste just as good as they look. Lucky Tracy. Well, the first episode of Queen Boss debuts this Saturday at 10 p.m. on Centric TV.